Hello and welcome to our live coverage of the day's news agenda on London for the Capitals clubs. The race for the top four looks all but over after Tottenham's 3-1 win against Chelsea at Stamford Bridge, with Dele Alley scoring a brace. The Blues were in desperate need of a win, but they now sit a huge eight points, adrift of their rivals. West Ham meanwhile beat Southampton 3-0 to give themselves breathing space at the bottom, with Mark Warnodovic the star man for David Moyes' side. Arsenal dispatched Stoke City by the same scoreline at the Emirates Stadium, with Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang continuing his hot streak in front of goal. We'll be bringing you all the updates from the capital here throughout the day building up to those games as well as keeping on top of all of the latest transfer news and speculation around the Premier League. Follow all the latest updates below. 09 36 Liverpool target Jorginho has edged closer to a potential move to England after his agent revealed that only Premier League clubs can afford him. Speaking on Italian radio, Santos said, He's being followed by big teams and that's normal because he plays at the highest levels for Napoli. Plus, we're talking about an international player. Now, to date, no official offers have arrived. Future in England? He has a certain value for Napoli, a certain figure that almost only Premier League clubs can afford. Jorginho, vies for the ball with Jesse Lingard at Wembley. Image, Glenn Kirk slash AFP slash Giddy Images 2144 Mauricio Pochettino has given an update on the fitness of Harry Kane and whether he will be able to start a next weekend's Premier League match at Stoke City. The striker came off the bench in Spurs 3-1 win at Stamford Bridge. Right here Harry Kane is fit. Again. Image, Michael Regan slash Giddy Images 16 colon 34 Manchester United have reportedly been snubbed by Antoine Griezmann who has instead decided on an £88 million transfer to Barcelona. The Atletico Madrid forward have been targeted by United by Jose Mourinho but has opted to join Barca this summer, according to The Sun. Image, Gonzalo Arroyo Moreno slash Giddy Images 14 colon 49 touted as a future England international. Newcastle defender Jamal Laskels is believed to be attracting interest from Chelsea. The ex-Nottingham Forest defender has become a key figure at St. James Park and it comes as no surprise to see him linked with a move away given his fine performances for the Magpies. There was talk of Laskels moving to Chelsea in the summer back in February, yet Raphael Benitez made it clear that he should remain on Tyneside. He has just signed a new contract this year so we don't have any problems. He is clever enough to understand that the best way for him to improve is to stay here and do well in every single training session and each game. Here's what Newcastle fans have had to say about the rumors. Misi Badswayi is challenged by Jamal Laskels. Image, Julian Finney slash Giddy Images 12 07 linked with a move to Spurs in the past. Reports suggest that Manchester United may decide to cash in on Anthony Marshall come the summer. Having impressed in the first half of the season, the Frenchman has yet to find the net since the middle of January. According to the Mirror, he could be sold to bring in Gareth Bale this summer. Anthony Marshall, image, Matthew Peters slash Man United via Giddy Images 11 colon 56 It has been a rather frustrating season for Chelsea after their title success last year. While the Blues can still finish the campaign with some silverware by winning the FA Cup, they face an uphill battle to finish in the top four. Here's what Antonio Conte has had to say about his side's current league position. Antonio Conte during Chelsea's FA Cup win over Leicester City. Photo by Plum Images slash Leicester City FC via Kitty Images 10 colon 52 Dele Alley will be hoping to silence a number of people when Spurs face Chelsea this afternoon. While the England international has failed to match his performances from the previous two seasons, he's still contributed to 24 of the goals the Lily Whites have scored. With his England place now in question, Paul Merson has claimed that the youngster needs to start watching videos of Mohamed Salah in action. Read here to find out what else Merson has had to say. Dele Alli celebrates his goal at Bournemouth 9 colon 51 what a return for Harry Kane. Tipped to be on the sidelines for some time due to his ankle injury, the striker only ended up missing one Spurs game. With a vital clash at Chelsea on the agenda today. Football.London understands that the 24-year-old will be in the squad at Stamford Bridge. As expected, the news has gone down extremely well with the club's supporters. Here's what they've had to say. Harry Kane receives medical attention after picking up an injury against Bournemouth. Image, 
Adrian Dennis slash JFP slash Giddy Images 09 colon 48 amid, all the criticism Arsene has received this season, Stoke City's Paul Lambert has come out and backed his fellow manager. The pair will be in opposite dugouts today, yet, the Scotsman feels Winger is a victim of his own success. Read here to find out what else Lambert had to say. The managers during Arsenal's visit to Aston Villa, in 2014, image, Michael Regan slash Giddy Images 09 colon 46 having seen Joe Hart return in goal for West Ham, Adrian is reportedly considering his future at the club. Out of contract at the end, of the season, the Hammers are believed to be keen on getting the Spaniard to commit his future to the club with a new long-term contract. However, he now wants, certain assurances before signing on the dotted line. Read here. Adrian in action. Image. Ian Kington slash JFP slash Giddy Images 22 colon 08. Tottenham have been boosted with the news that Harry Kane will be available to face Chelsea on Sunday. Football.London understands that the striker has been included in a squad for the huge clash at Stamford Bridge. Full story here. Harry Kane and Deli Alley celebrate the striker's goal against Arsenal. Photo by Adrian Dennis AFP slash Giddy Images 19 colon 35 Despite uncertainty surrounding the future of Arsene Wenger at Arsenal, Schalke midfielder Max Meyer is open to a move this summer, according to reports in Germany. The 22-year-old is set to become a free agent at the end of the season and a move to the Emirates Stadium looks possible. Full story here. Max Meyer Photo by Niels Petter Nielsen slash Umbrella slash Giddy Images 15 colon 15 Well. Wow, that's according to the Daily Mirror. The Belgian defender's future with Tottenham is in doubt and Chelsea are ready to step up their attempts to sign him this summer. Manchester United, Barcelona and Paris Saint-Germain are also said to keen on a 29-year-old. Full story here. Toby Alderweireld, image, Gareth Copley slash Giddy Images 16 colon 38 Zinedine Zidane insists he wants Cisco to stay at Real Madrid, but understands the midfielder's frustrations. Isco has started only 18 of 29 league games this season and raised doubts about his future at Real after playing for Spain. But Zidane has reiterated his desire to keep the playmaker at the Bernabeu. Everyone can interpret his words however, they like but I'm not bothered by them. Perhaps he's not happy as he doesn't play as often for us as for Spain and he wants to play more but, he's very important to us. Isco scored a hat-trick for Spain against Argentina. Photo by Pierre Philippe Marcou AFP slash Giddy Images 16 colon 07 striker George Nunn, one of the hottest young prospects in the crew, Alex Academy, has signed for Chelsea, according to our colleagues at the Crew Chronicle. The 16 year old, from Nantwich, has decided against signing scholarship forms at Gristie Road in favor of a switch to Stamford Bridge. Tottenham were also thought to be in the running for the youngster. 14 colon 47 Liverpool have reportedly stepped up contract talks with youngster Rune Brewster. Jurgen, Klopp's side are even prepared to scrap plans to sign Air Bay Leipzig's team owner for £90 million in order to give Brewster more of a chance next season. 14 colon 17 Chelsea's clash with Spurs, on Sunday will play a key part in how the top four race will finish, and Antonio Conti's side know they must win to stand any chance of catching their London rivals. The Italian has some key decisions to make, including who starts up for rent. Alvaro Morata or January signing Olivier Giroud. Blues fans have had their say. Read, here photo by Glenn Kirk AFP slash Giddy Images 1229 Arsenal center back Laurent Koscielny has revealed that he has taken up yoga in an attempt to prolong his playing career. Read here, image. Julian Finney slash Getty, images 12 colon 15 Real Madrid are reportedly considering a move for Roman goalkeeper Allison as they view difficulties in signing Thibaut Courtois and David De Gea. According to Az, Real would prefer a move for either of the Premier League duo, but they fear Chelsea and United will refuse to negotiate. Photo by Sean Botterill slash Getty images 11 colon 46 Arsenal have been linked with a host of players, ahead of the summer transfer window, but who are they? Our Gunners correspondent Charles Watts has taken a look at who's been mislint at his eye on ahead of a potential summer overhaul. Read here Sven mislint at as his eye on several players. Image, DPA picture aligns 10 colon 52 according to La Paris Yuan. Thomas Tuchel is on his way to Paris Saint-Germain in the summer. The German has been linked with the managerial jobs at Arsenal and Chelsea, but it seems he could be replacing Unai Emery. 
10 colon 51 Belgium manager Roberto Martinez has warned Tottenham, defender Toby Alderweireld that his place in the World Cup squad is under threat if he cannot get into Spurs' first team. The centre-back has had an injury hit, season, and been out of favour with Mauricio Pochettino even when fit. Image, Gareth Copley slash Giddy Images 1029 West Ham are confident of signing Russia captain Fyodor Smolov. According to the Mirror, the 28-year-old Chris Nadar striker can move for £15 million. Image, Kirill Kudryabzhev slash JFP slash Giddy Images 09 colon 55 Watford boss Javi Gracia has admitted that the club will discuss any offers for star player Abdullah Dukoran, the summer, amid interest from Arsenal, Tottenham, and Liverpool. Full story 09 colon 41 according to Spanish publication as Bayern Munich will target Chelsea striker Alvaro Morata if they lose Robert Lewandowski in the summer. The Polish forward is reportedly ready to force a move to Real Madrid. Photo by Michael Regan slash Giddy Images 09 colon 36 Real Madrid midfielder was in stunning form for Spain midweek, scoring a hat-trick against Argentina. But will we be seeing the 25-year-old in the Premier League next season? According to our friends at the Mirror, Manchester City are confident they can land the star in a £75 million deal. Chelsea and Spurs are also said to be interested. Isco scored a hat trick for Spain against Argentina. Photo by Pierre Philippe Marc AFP slash Giddy Images 09 colon 25 Arsenal have reportedly held talks with Freiburg for defender Chaler Soyanku. The 21 year old is rated as one of the most exciting prospects in the Bundesliga and has attracted attention from Manchester City. Liverpool, and Chelsea. However, in a blow to Arsenal's hopes, Soyanku admitted last year that he dreams of working with Manchester United boss Jose Mourinho. I admire Jose Mourinho, not just, his football but his philosophy. I would like to work with him in the future. 17 colon 21 Mosa Dembele has shocked Spurs fans with the news that he may not sign a new contract with the club and can even leave this summer. Full story photo by Matthew Peters slash Man United via Giddy Images 16 colon 44 Schalke's sporting director admits he is re-signed to Max Meyer leaving this summer. The German star has been linked with a move to Arsenal or Liverpool. Read here, image, Patrick Stoller slash JFP slash Giddy Images 1612 is reported in the Birmingham Mail. Aston Villa director of football Steve Brown says captain John Terry has indicated he would like to stay with the club. The former Chelsea skipper had been expected to retire and return to Stamford, bridge in a coaching capacity, but he can yet prolong his stay at Villa Park.